Self love is finding your own voice and recognizing that you might like different things to your friends or your family. Self love is filling your own cup, doing things that make you happy, that bring you laughter and joy just for the sake of doing them. And don't forget, filling your cup, loving yourself first, is also saying no to things that you don't want to do. But the more you can start using your voice with the simple things, the more confident you'll feel when it gets harder to say, actually, no, I don't like that. No, stop, I don't want to do that. No, actually, that doesn't make me happy. If you ever find yourself in a situation that you feel peer pressured and you need to get out of that situation quick, smart, using one of the three P's is a very quick way of getting out. So the peach theory says you can be the ripest, juiciest peach in the world. There's still going to be someone who doesn't like peaches. Spend more time with people who love peaches and allow you to be the ripest, juiciest peach you can be and maybe limit your time with those people who don't. Understand that friends will come and go in and out of your life and this doesn't make you a bad person, it just makes you human. So we would encourage you to embrace that relationship with your parents and your siblings first. However, if you don't have a good relationship with them, then still acknowledging the need to have that older trusted adult in your life to turn to when you need advice. Who felt relieved a little bit by sharing their story? Yeah, look around. You're not alone. Is anyone sitting there thinking, I need to have a courageous conversation? Does anyone need, know they need to talk to someone? Amazing. So we're going to share these three steps with you to help you make this process a little bit easier. We're not up the front here telling you what to do and what not to do. We have made many, many, many mistakes. But your good friends, like this good friend, will help you talk about it. What are the repercussions? What are the consequences that you have not thought of? And it's okay not to be okay sometimes. And we really forget that and people don't talk about it. You made people feel like it was a safe environment to talk about it and like you wouldn't be judged or anything. It's really good to learn how to say no to people and to not get yourself into situations where you feel pressure to not say no. This is what the Big Sister Experience is all about. And supporting the sisterhood basically means that girls support girls. The sisterhood means that whether you're best friends or whether you've met this woman for the first time, that you're going to encourage her to be the best peach that she can be. 